Um, I've been watching the Tigress, and yeah. uh, they have a lot of great additions. Mm -hmm. You know, they have their captain Adora, who played in the NBA, WNBA, WNBA. sorry. Um, Evelyn, who has also played in WNBA now in Europe. So they have a lot of additions. Um, Ezine, who was MVP for um, Afro Basket, they're going to be fine. Mm -hmm. um, they didn't just win that just by fluke. They put in the hard work. Yeah. They, they're building that synergy. They're working hard together. They have a great coach. And I think they have a great chance at qualifying. Unfortunately, the U.S. is in their bracket. But they met the U.S. in the World Cup. And they didn't win. But you can see that they were hungry. They were ready to mm -hmm. fight. And they did put up a good battle. So it'll be interesting to see you know, how they match up this time around with U.S. Um, Serbia is also a great team, and so is Mozambique, but I believe the girls have what it takes. I just hope that they can get to camp and all the noise, you know, per diems and, you know, NBF taking care of them, those things won't get in the way mm -hmm. and distract them for what they, for, from what they need to do on the court. Yeah. But I believe they do have the pieces and what it takes to qualify for this Olympics. Definitely. All right, uh, looking forward to that one. And of course, wishing the girls well. And still talking about the Tigers uh, for the expectations, uh, Elizabeth Balogun may be handed her first national team debut alongside 2019 Zenit Bank Women Basketball League's most valuable player, talking about uh, Musa Mojanatu. And this is um, uh, Musa Mojanatu, fantastic player, and she yeah. deserved to get that uh, MVP of the tournament. Another uh, point guard talking about uh, Sarah Ogo, Okay, it's been a long time I saw Sarah play for Nigeria. She has been since been recalled to the team to replace Ukwe Atoso. They are a completely different team from the last Olympics. Mm. I think facts have proven that in their wins over the last few years. And their rankings as well. And their rankings as well. So I think we have to give them that credit in mm. the coaches doing a really good job with the players mm -hmm. and bringing in the right necessary players to get this done. And I'm happy that the majority of the team is the same team that played last year, NAFO Basket, the Olympic, I'm sorry, the World Cup. World Cup. So it's, it's going to be a good chance for them. Mm -hmm. I just hope they get to camp on time and there's none of those, you know, distractions. outside distractions mm -hmm. and barriers to get them off track. But trust me, I, I have my money on the Tigers.